Hello, this is Maria with California Thrifter, and I, this is a small haul um, that I picked up, I think it was the day before yesterday, it's very small, this was, I was in the town of Houston, Houston, California, which is about 20 minutes away from my town, and um, I was babysitting my granddaughters, and we had to go buy in, buy this, uh, it's, a, it's not a thrift store, it's an antique store. It's called Mrs. Potts Antiques and Collectibles or something like that, Attic. Anyway, um, I picked up these two. Um, they're like little Christmas trees and they, they're like the ones from the dollar store. But I think these ones are more, um, more rigid. And even if they were from the dollar store, I, I needed them. And so that you have two of them that they glow in different colors. See, I like them because, um, like when I my granddaughter's, uh, my daughter's house when I was babysitting, my granddaughter uses little Christmas trees as nightlight. So I thought this was adorable. I'm going to use them on my display. Um, so that's what it is. That's those two. And then I love their bags. It's called Mrs. Spots Attic, Collect Antiques and Collect Collectibles and more. And it's a tiger bag. They're adorable. And they wrap everything so really, really good. And I paid a total of um, $10 for all this. But um, this is something that I, I don't have and I wanted for my collection. So... Actually, the most expensive ones was the the salt, the Santa salt and pepper shaker. Sorry for the crinkling, guys. I should have had this open before. <clears throat> but I picked up these two. They're Christmas um, Santas. Santa Clauses and they're the salt and pepper shakers. And they both have their stopper, except this one's over here. The other one is it's in here. Uh, I'll find a way. I'm gonna find a way too. Because I don't think I'm gonna sell them. They're gonna go on my display uh, with my other um, Santas. Not that I collect Santas, but I don't have salt and pepper shakers. And I like to do like when I do my shelf. I like to kind of, my Christmas shelf or holiday shelf, whatever, I like to have some little things on there. So I have those two. And those were, um, and this was 20% uh, off on the, on the booth, number 70 booth. And they were $3 a piece, so $6 for the set. But these I'm going to keep. I'm going to keep these. And this was all like in and out because they were, I think they were about to close. And then these were $4, $2 each. And then you got the discount. And there's this little guy and a girl and they're like sitting on a, and he's playing the, like the bandoline or whatever he called. And she's playing something else. They're both playing um, an, a musical instrument. And these are adorable. And these are not, and, um, they were marked with something, not, and then, then they marked it out with some, I don't know if it was a price or something, but they look like they're lustrous, they're ceramic, they're really cute. I love the colors. And they look vintage to me. And I think that was it. It's just the six items, okay? If you like what you see, subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know which one was your favorite. 
Um, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you for stopping by. Yeah, I forgot. I also have, um, this is from another, um, this is from Community Hospice, I believe. And there were just a few little things. I picked up this little plate and um, I just like to pick them up sometimes to put, you can use it as a trinket and uh, 50 cents. So it was, I picked that up. And then these, um, I also picked up and I've never seen one of these before. It's one of my kissing angels. And this is just a boy. But he's got the Christmas holly all the way around. And this was 50 cents. But this I'm going to keep. Um, but they are salt um, salt and pepper shakers. This is the boy. Uh, and he is the, the pepper. But he's got his hands behind. And he's bucking up for a kiss. Maybe he is the, he's the girl. Because it looks like he has... But it's that of this, like, they almost look like Linux. It is so pretty. It has a mark on the bottom. And I think they're made in Japan. I can't make out what it is. Again, guys, I lost my, um, what do you call it? Um, my magnifying glass. And these are going to go on my life. It just uh, looks like Mrs. Santa Claus. She's all pudgy and stuff, and she has some, I don't know if this was a handmade piece or something, but she's adorable, very adorable. So you might see this after the fact, because later on I'm having my life, but I think she's a Mrs. Claus. You got a little hole up here, maybe to put a little candle, I'm not sure, and she's like porcelain or something. And she's adorable. I also have this couple. They're like carolers. They do have a little bit. Of, they're white and gold. Very light. I think this is a handmade piece. And it says Flora. Ro something Roma. But they're adorable. Adorable. It's like a. And. There's a little flea bite right here on the bottom. But otherwise, they're great, great condition. And then I have, I have this, it says uh, it's a grandpa, grandparents, Christmas 1986. And it says grand, grandparents are never far from thought from throughout I'm sorry grandparents are never far from thought ever near in love and it's just a little and he is um, a hallmark I believe 19 fine porcelain and I think he's 1998 but it's adorable. And that's going to be on my live sale today at 10. I just, um, I'm trying to go through all this stuff. And I meant to do a, a haul video last night when I got home. But I was so exhausted. I just uh, text a friend and then I, I just went to bed. I went to bed around 8 o'clock. And, um, and then I slept for a little bit, then couldn't sleep, and I ended up um, texting one of my fellow YouTubers or subscribers. Um, and probably she was in bed already herself. But I uh, chatted a little bit with uh, Maria from Maria Ladybug. Um, she was showing a collection of her, um, her angels. She has these beautiful angels, so... If you're not a subscriber to her channel, by all means do it because she has, she lives in, um, oh my God, I'm sorry, Maria, my mind just went blank, blank. She lives overseas. 
She's in Sweden, and she has a Sweden voice. Very sweet lady. Her um, YouTube channel is called Maria Ladybug, and uh, she's just adorable. Very, very cute lady. Very nice. Um, I adore her. I've never met her in person, but I, I think she's a very nice lady. Anyway, um, I hope everybody's doing well. And uh, I'm sorry for the lag between the two. Um, and then just tell me what, what is your favorite. And I'll see you guys later. Please subscribe, ring the bell. And this way you'll get notified when we have, when I have new stuff. I will see you later. Bye-bye.